quick. This ore here, potassium nitrate ore. Jasper. Yeah. Also from Emenda to, to Senigmatica, Isaac. <laughs> All these ones with names are from that mod. Yeah. Like Jasper um, itself is from Quark by the looks of it. But, uh, right. but no, you're right. Oh, there's another spawner, man. God, what is this place? What's, what's that spawning, Isaac? You're gonna say it's gonna spawn oh, no, it's just a, it's a monster box. It's a, it's a THX Xbox, man. Run. Oh. <laughs> Actually, I want to know what it does spawn. Hold on. I also oh, want to hear the THX sound again. Social distance, Isaac. Careful. You don't want to be larvid. Ah, oh, yeah, good. Don't want to be larvid. I also kind of want them to be larvid. Oh, was a witch. Yeah, okay. you're stupid. Yeah, you want to get rid of her real quick, man. You want to throw stuff at me, Isaac, as if I'm some kind of terrible actor at a theatre play. Would you, um, if it, if it was socially acceptable, would you do that? <laughs> throw a tomato at someone. <laughs> I, I'm too British to do that, Isaac. I feel so bad. Even if they were horrendous, mm, right? You wouldn't be investing in... I wouldn't be investing in, in tomatoes. tomatoes. <laughs> yeah. People do make a good point that we should get a shield as well. Uh, also, we need to find our way out of here, which is... Like here? Yeah, it's here. Up there. Mm. Yeah, this place is weird, Isaac. Um, like, yeah, sure. Okay, gold. Yeah, we can't get that yet. Um, how much string have you got, man? Five, Isaac. Five string. Right. Uh, that's good, actually. I think, so I assume you can craft four string into a wall. Does that work? That, it, it that works. Nice. That is, okay. That works. Now, I don't know. I always think that you can do it. But at the same time, people always tell me I'm a, a silly billy for thinking that I can make a bed with different kinds of wool. You can, I'm fairly certain. You can mix and match. I feel like aware. maybe you can't. <laughs> I think it might be like a modded thing, maybe. Um, but alas, we actually don't have what it takes anyway. Yes, we need one more wool. I'm assuming you don't have any string. I have one string. Uh, I also have one. Um, I was hoping we'd have uh, enough tattered cloth, but... Do you have one tattered cloth by any chance? Um, I don't think so. Uh, I'm, I'm squinting. No, no, just, I got a few iron chunks and some copper chunks. So I would just, they, they caught my eye just because they look different than what I'm used to. Right. But no, no tattered cloths, Isaac. Okay. No tattered cloths. Um, I forgot. Vanilla now has the, um, the blast furnace. Oh, Oh, what, for um, smelting things faster, is it? It smelts them faster, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm going to try and make one of those real quick. But yeah, if we could get... We might, I mean, there is that spider spotter down there. We could, You could probably use that to your advantage, right? Just to go try and, and get, get some string. Yeah. yeah do that. You only need a few more. Here's the one I have, by the way. Oh, cheers, man. I'm just trying to dump my inventory as much as possible. Yeah, I'll go get that. Uh, did I pick that up from you? Yes, I did. All right. Sign our Isaac. I'll see you in uh, just a second. So we Sayonara, get man. These spiders. Uh, someone in the in the Twitch chat did say, Nick, that they um they want to hear you whisper Spanish words into their ears. So, I mean, if you have any more Spanish words that you could whisper. Right. Hold on. Where's that? Where's that? Uh, here we go. Emenda tu senigmatica. No bueno. Donde esta la biblioteca? Is that... <laughs> just... <laughs> That, did that even come through? I think it did. Yeah, I heard it. Oh, that's all that matters then. Uh, I don't know many Spanish words. Well, like off the top of my head anyway. Okay. Um, I mean, if you've got any, I take, I take, uh, I take requests. If you want to, um, if you want to, you know, put some in the chat. Hey. The five dollars per request. Um. <laughs> uh, oh, there's oh, yeah, one string sitting again. on the floor right here, Isaac. So I just need one. <laughs> Come on, spiders. Uh, oh, man. Bloody. <laughs> I come down when I want the spiders to spawn. They don't spawn, Isaac. Have you got Jeez. one of the torches, man? I'm getting rid of them. Yeah. There we go. Uh, apparently, also, they took away the, uh, like, they took away the various types of wall recipe when they added in different colored beds. So now the bed color might, like, correlate to the wall you use. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, no, I know what you mean. I did wonder that. There we go. Spawning. Okay, right. I have a blast furnace. Okay, good. I, I have... It's, it's twice as fast, man. That is well good, actually. I wasn't expecting to be twice as fast. Isaac, I have the string. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I'm coming. So I think we should probably start moving our you know base of operations out of the cave, ideally. Yeah. I'm not going to lie. It's not, it's not best for the feng shui of our selves, Isaac, to be holed up in a cave. 
So yes, I, I concur with that. Let's get out of there. As soon as I find my way out of this place, which, you know, might not happen. I'll come down. I'll, I'll, I'll yeah, you, 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 you feel, you're very close. You're walking the wrong way now. No, yeah, back this way. This way. Is this the right then, way? Oh, back? No, you might be lower down than I'm anticipating. Hold on, I might, I'm I here. Might, let me come up here. Over here, Nick, over here. No, back, back, back. Turn around. Hi. Hello. Hi. It's over here. Hi. Thanks, man. <laughs> maybe oh, maybe another here. waypoint might work. <laughs> it's here. I was walking straight past this. Uh, you know what? I'll grab, I'm going to grab some of this, uh, I'm going to put one of these violet cave crystals down here, like a line of them. So you can see where, where, to where go. the cave entrance is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Nice one. Um, right. Bedtime, Isaac. It's past my bedtime. Here we go. Oh yeah. Let's see if you can sleep on your own. Yes. I mean, I've only got enough wool for one bed, so I hope this works. If I press E, I've got nourished for three minutes and my chicken legs are gold. Isaac. It's not two wool for a bed, it's three, isn't it? Yeah. All right, I'm coming back. <laughs> no, I've come back down. <laughs> do, you have, uh, do you have these golden chicken legs, man? In your hunger? I have one golden chicken leg right now. No, like all of my chicken legs are like solid gold. Oh, no, Isaac. You've been eating some You've been eating some good stuff. Been eating too much, uh, too much pasta with mutton chops, man. Yeah, clearly. Madness. Right, now I've just got to find my way to this stupid spider spawner. I'm, I'm assuming it's where you are. Uh, no, no, it's the other way. But there is this here. Look at this. Oh, wow. God, this, this isn't light on spawners, is it, Isaac? Well, I don't know if this is a... a I see a, a creeper. Okay, I'll... Um, we'll let him do his do his business. Yeah, you let him do his business. I'm going to go find that spider spawner. Right. And get like a... Tip. What was it I need? Three more strings. You need, th yeah, you need enough for one bed. Or maybe yeah. two. Uh, maybe oh, there's two. a skeleton spawner here. Oh. Yes, you are right. We're not light on spawners at all. No, no, not at all. I'm going to put a waypoint here and we can come back if uh, if needs be. I'm going to head back up. So I think to get into create, like I said, the first thing we need is like the water wheel. Mm. And uh, the water wheel, let's have a look. Water wheel is pretty easy. It's uh, eight slabs with a large cog wheel. A large cog wheel is four buttons, four planks, and that andesite alley, which is just iron nuggets and andesite. So very, very easy stuff. Right, I see. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Um, Some of the YouTube comments says uh, that mossy thing, Isaac, is a stronghold. I did see that, yeah. Yeah, that could be interesting to explore when we're not naked. Um, that, that, yeah, that seems very much so like a good situation. Um, it's no longer night, Nick, which is, you know, okay, that's unfortunate. Good. Given I mean, way, your, yeah. uh, given your current situation. The, the old bed, but yeah, don't worry, Isaac. I've got, I've got bed, finally. Um. That's good, man. Put it sound like here. There we go. Right. We'll see if that works uh, in Lemo in the, in the evening. Oh yeah, I do like that. It makes me feel very um, very fresh and refreshed, Isaac. When I hear those uh, the birds chirping. Yeah. <laughs> I live in the city now, Isaac. So it's not something I'm used to. When I used to live in the uh, in the country, Isaac, there's like a bird's nest right outside my bedroom bedroom window. Yeah. So like four in the morning, they go. <laughs> and I'll be like, oh god, it's time to wake up. And I check my phone; it's like four oh seven a.m. <laughs> well, <laughs> bloody birds! Terrible. I'm amazed Isaac. that that, that painter was quite a light sleeper, man. I, I would have thought you were um, a more heavy sleeper. I don't know. Yeah, it depends on the day, Isaac. It depends on um, you know circumstances. Yeah. How late I've slept? You know. Yeah. How how heavy? how heavy I, I was before I slept. <laughs> right, what, yeah. What I ate. Um, <laughs> if you I packed on a couple of kilos before <laughs> bed, then... <laughs> how, how much food coma I was in. <laughs> right. Yeah, oh. that, makes, that makes sense, man. Yeah, that exactly. Sense. Oh, man. Here we go. Okay. I'm going to take some... I don't think we need cobblestone, but I'll take some just in case. So let's have a look here. I'm going to make some slabs. Perfect. And then let me bookmark this water wheel. Oh, yeah, here let's we go. See. Here so, we bloody go. Andesite alloy. I need to craft up my iron nuggets. I also need some andesite. That would be a perfect place to uh, to start. Thankfully, Nick, we have an abundance of andesite. It's one of the only things we do have. Jeez. Perfect. And then I need four buttons. Uh, we'll go uno, dos, tres, cuatro in the, <laughs> the Spanish mm. name of things. And then, boom, Nick, I've got a freaking water wheel, man. Here we go. Oh, look at, th look at that. That's not allowed in Minecraft. <laughs> Well, so looking at the create quest line, 
The first quest is actually like just another checkbox quest. It says, welcome to create. At its core, create follows the same primary purpose as vanilla redstone. Give the player items to enable fanciful creations. What sort of creations you ask? Well, just about anything. Make rideable trains, tunnel bores, massive functional windmills, or even working Rubik's cubes. What? Whoa, Your imagination okay. is the limit. That's on the agenda, man. Fully working I mean, Rubik's cube. I mean... Naturally, with so much uh, ground to cover, these quests will not be exhaustive. Instead, the goal will be to introduce basic concepts of Create to give you a solid footing to begin experimenting on your own. So I think Create has had like a big overhaul since we last played it. Right, I see. Yeah, I, I think see. the 1.16 version has like, got a bunch of new stuff. I mean, in take a look at this wrench, well. Isaac. If you if you claim the wrench and put it in your open it in your hand, it the looks detail. like you're playing a different game. I know. It's like some like animated freaking high detail thing. It moves like it it's moves. got a cogwheel. <laughs> what it game moves. is this? <laughs> this isn't like Minecraft. This is like we're playing. Get I don't this know, out of my game. Get, get out of here with your advanced <laughs> graphics. <laughs> Oh man. Oh, oh, here we go. Man. Let me uh grab this guy. So I'm thinking we might just put the water wheel like here for now. Oh my, that's not what I wanted. Can I make a normal shovel? <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> I don't want that. Like, when you try to make a normal shovel, you get that excavator, but I think there's like an option. Yeah, so in the crafting table above the output, there's like a little thing that lets you pick if if two recipe two items have the same recipe, there's a little thing that lets you pick which one you want to pick. Oh, uh, that's nice. Yeah, that's good. So are you planning to like Put some water here. Yeah, I've got a bucket. like a little bath. Isaac. Exactly. Yeah. So okay, I'm thinking we do like, you know, water wheel like this. We even have freaking glass, man. Mm, oh, yeah. Do you know what I mean? Obviously, we need this part open so we can uh So we can take it. our shaft out. Yeah. Yeah, so we can use our shafts. Um, but then after that, we're pretty much good to go. So I yeah, think... a bit of flowing water, is it, will it be? Yeah, I think we want it here. Also, I'm kind of covering up our cave entrance because I built it a bit, a bit close. That's but, right. But yeah, if we do something like this, and then we put down like water, I think maybe here. Yeah, and I'll put Whoa. like a dirt there. I know, right? Look at it's that. It's fitting quite quick. Yeah. I guess I didn't need to go. I thought I could. Uh, maybe I don't need to go like here. I thought I did, but I guess I don't. So maybe this look last bit that. of wall is not needed. But yeah, look at this, man. That's great. I am wasting glass, but you know, we can make more. That's fair. Yeah, it's, it's a bit of sand. A bit of sand, that's all. Yeah. Yeah, I like it. So now we just make our raw shaft and then we pull out of there and then, you know, we just grind some ores, Isaac, and then we X2 the damn things. Yeah. Do you want to look at how to make the uh, the big grinding wheels? Uh, yeah. Are they called grind? grind if you type in wheel. Wheel. They are called crushing wheels. Ah, okay. Crushing. Oh, my. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> We're not in Kansas anymore, man. Oh my <laughs> god. Yeah, that you're right about that overhaul, Isaac. <laughs> what on earth? We need a mechanical crafter to start. They they do push us through this. You'll see the the grinding wheel quest is um is after that. that uh, people sense. are telling us that a millstone might suffice early game. Is that from uh let's have a look. Mill stone. Oh yeah, I do see it here. A kinetic component suitable for grinding inserted materials can be powered by adjacent cogwheels or by connecting the shaft to the bottom. Results have to be extracted from the component. So, oh no, yeah, this looks a lot easier. The millstone. Yeah. Oh yeah, no, this looks tremendously easier. Okay. Do you see Let's it? Have a look. Uh, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. That's that's much. That's, <laughs> that's much more nicer. my level, Isaac. That's more my level. Yeah, um, that's interesting good. observation. Oh yeah. For completing this quest, we get a rare create loot box. Ooh. Do you reckon we'll get some create goodies from it, Isaac? Which like quest a, are we completing? Uh, the millstone quest. Which is oh, the, one second. There it's are a actually, few more. It's the next. It's the next one on directly down on uh, the create tab. Um, so the third one. Start start at the top and then the third one down, directly down. Oh yeah, I do um, see that. I've just completed three quests, by the way, because the ones above that were all tick box quests. Same, yeah, that was uh, handy, very handy. Yeah. So what do we get from that? We got um, got minecart. I got engineer's goggles. Yeah, I put them on, Isaac. We look we look like the Wright brothers now. Oh, my, mine, mine kind of go over the crown. Oh yeah, it does. <laughs> but, it does. But yeah, uh, do you want to try your sleeping? I was just uh, about to say. Method? It's time to test out this bed. Yeah. Yeah. See comfy. If that works. Yeah, a little bit, little bit too narrow, but you know, oh yeah, because it's supportive. Oh, it totally does work. That's nice, great. nice. 
Yeah, I was a little worried that you we, we might burn uh, both need beds, but uh, thankfully we're good. We're we good. We're good. We're good. Oh yeah, look, I see this raw shaft. God, look at oh, just that raw shaft spinning around. So I have. Can I just do like? Okay, so I think yeah, we're going to need a gearbox because the shaft has to go in the bottom of this. So we need to be able to like ninety degree the the rotational. Oh, okay, okay. Kinetic energy, you know what I mean? Yeah, I know, I know what you mean. So we need like a this kind of gearbox. So we need four cog wheels and an andesite casing. Is it a, Isaac? Is it a gear shift we need, or a gear box? Slightly more costly than a pair of cogs. Oh, can we use cogs? Oh, dude, look, they're so right. I hate it. <laughs> it works. <laughs> Holy crap, it works. It does work. Amazing. I apologize for doubting you, Chip. There okay, you go. so it's a little awkward. Because it's a little high up there, right? But uh, let's see. If we go like this way, I'm just going to make a little staircase. Right. So we can get up here and I can put down this uh, millstone. Oh, here we go. There it is. There it is. So yeah, now it says, when you look at it, it's a 64 SU at current speed. Right. Now, looking in the quest book, Millstones have been used for ages, representing some of our oldest technology still in use. They're far more efficient than grinding things by hand. Creates Millstone is an excellent early way to stretch your ores a little further. Be sure to wash the resulting crushed ore pieces to further enhance your yield. Mmm. Okay. Can be powered by adjacent cogwheels or by connecting the shaft to uh, the bottom. When powered, starts applying milling starts applying milling recipes to any item inserted from the side or the top of the block. So I think we might need like a hopper to actually like, you know, insert into this. I don't think I can like yeah. just manually insert. Uh, I do have th four iron. There's so one, one in more. this chest. Like ingot? Ingot. Oh, perfect. In here. That's a hopper good to go. Uh, while you do that, I'm going to go and like have a look for some iron because I feel like we need it. I feel like we need it. Cool. Copper... Copper. Oh, okay. Chat's also uh, very correctly pointed out that we can just drop the ore on top. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I was going to say, can we drop it on top? Um, give it a go. It does work. Yeah, no, like it, it does work. Now, I don't know where it comes out. <laughs> it does yeah, also say. Yeah, next question. Yeah, so it says in the, in the tool tip, uh, results have to be extracted from the component. So, like, I'd assume we need some kind of hopper to pull the results like the the product out, right? Yeah. Oh, right. Yeah. Let me test a a thesis here, Nick. I'm thinking okay, maybe out. maybe we can do well, like this. Does that work? No, that doesn't work. <laughs> where's my bleeding iron? I was really hoping because it says mm, it does say can be powered by an adjacent cog wheel or by connecting to the shaft at the bottom. Maybe it's just on the wrong side. You need a smaller cogwheel to turn it. Oh, I see. Okay, we're, get, we're getting there, Nick. You know, the, it's, it's coming the, the together. Bro, the mind is rusty, <laughs> Isaac, when it comes to... It's been a while. It's been a while. I, I mean, I, I think it's just it's new stuff. New, new tech. Let's yeah. try this. Okay, I'm coming back. Oh, I got some iron. Oh, okay. It seemed to disappear into the, into the abyss. Okay. All right, Nick. It's the most <laughs> bizarre or, like, processing system I think we've ever set up. Amazing. I'm coming up. But I think <laughs> that it works. <laughs> Let's have a look. <laughs> yeah, just you wait, man. So, like, I dropped... I had to put, like, a new small gear down to, to get it to spin on the side. Right. And then you drop the gold in from the top, but then it does eject the... If you look in the hopper, it's ejecting the crushed gold off. Oh, yeah. So it you're is. guaranteed one. It does only have a 60... Oh, no, hold up. Let's have a look here. Gold. If I put gold, gold chunks, you're guaranteed one gold. You got a 25% chance to get a second gold, so not crazy high. Right. And then a 5% chance to get zinc. So it's not quite as good as the crushing wheels, but obviously they're a bit more expensive. Um, it did mention washing our gold ore. Ah, so if you uh if you hover over one of these gold uh ore crushed pieces in the item hopper and press U. Uh yes. Oh, bulk washing. Yeah. We can turn one crushed gold ore into at least 10 nuggets, potentially 15 nuggets, which gets us, you know, more than an ingot's worth. Almost two. Not quite two, though. Yeah, so it's like <laughs> you might get 
two crushed. And then from the each crushed, you might get like five or six, I guess, extra nuggets. So you'll always get one extra nugget from washing. Because obviously it's nine yeah. nuggets per ingot and you get ten. I believe so. Kind of all right, I guess. <laughs> I mean, it works. It does also, work. Also, I'm being told that we can like make this gear faster by putting it next to the, the small one. So maybe the big small technique does still work. That like, you know, do something like faster. this yeah. instead. Oh, yeah. Do you yeah. see that blue? Like, do you see that blue? Yeah, like, it looked like a little, little thing was like spinning around with it. Yeah, it's like speed. <laughs> so I assume we could. Uh, right now, we have to drop things in the top. Like, yes. Like, I've got eight that? gold. Yeah. Oh, you got yours in. How do? How come you got yours in ore form? Uh, I mined some with my stone hammer. And I oh. think it just. Yeah, just standard gold ore. Oh, yeah, and it did it. I get all mine in chunk form. See, I got some iron. Thanks, chat, by the way, for pointing this out. Uh, I got my iron in chunk form, but yeah, the gold was just in gold ore form. Unless I got it from like a rogue block. Oh, yeah. This right. Is... But yeah, so we could put like another hopper on top of this to like automate it more fully so you don't have to throw things at it. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yeah. And we could even, I guess, have like a furnace underneath if we wanted to auto smelt. But I do think uh, that one, we should open these rare crit loot boxes now that we oh, have 100%. them. 100%. Let's do that. Yeah. Oh. Okay. You don't get to open them. They're auto opened as you get them. Right, I see. I don't have the task complete. For the, oh, you might have to pick the millstone up. Ah. Right, hold on. Let me just slowly. Do I have a pickaxe? No, I can use this hammer, right? Boom. That worked? Uh, let's have a look. Uh, no, but I don't know if I picked it up. It's in the hopper, man. It totally is, isn't it? There it is. <laughs> yeah, there it is. Completed millstone. Right. Nice. And then I put this back. Do you just like face downwards when you put this down? I, mean, you, I don't think you had to break the gear box, uh, the, like the, the, the gear as well. I just broke the millstone. I think the gear goes with it. I think if something's attached to something else. But like, do you have the gear? Uh, I'm assuming it's in the hopper as well. Oh, no. Nope. Oh, no, I do. I have the gear. Okay. I have four gears. So I, I'm I'll, do, I'll do this. And then you just put the, the millstone on top of the hopper. There, there you go. go. Perfect. Cool. Uh, I got uh, I got two powered toggle latches. Oh, I got oh my goodness. Sixteen tree fertilizer. Oh, wow. I mean, don't mind if I bloody do. A lever that can be toggled by a redstone pulse. So it's like redstone, 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 redstone. Like as it toggles, as the redstone applies, it kind of toggles on and off. Can't think of an immediate use for it, but you know, maybe right. maybe eventually. Interesting. Yeah, might crack something not? there. But yeah, so like next up, if we're going to work our way kind of towards the crushing wheel, I think the mechanic, well, I guess next up, we probably want to work towards the fan, right? So we can wash. Yes. Yes. That mean, that would make sense. So the fan required, if you type in, uh, if we just look at the the recipe here. Yeah. The fan behind flowing water, the fan is pretty easy to make. It's a shaft, andesite casing, two cog wheels, and then a propeller. The andesite casing, super easy, wood, and just andesite alloy. Uh, but then the propeller does require andesite alloy and four iron plates so for that we're gonna have to get the uh the presser the mechanical press you remember the right. machine that kaplunks down onto the mm. onto the iron ingots and makes them into plates i remember so, i remember yeah we can do that i wonder how expensive the conveyor belts are as well they're actually maybe just called belts i think it is conveyor oh no that's from immersive engineering yeah belt they are called oh my goodness is a Mechanical harvester and a mechanical plow. What in the world? Uh, surely they still have belts, right? I'm looking in the quest book to see if I can spot them. Mm, you'd think they would still have Yeah, them, mechanical belts are what they're called. Mechanical belts. Oh, of course. They're made from dried kelp. Oh, yeah. Right. So you need to build like a kelp farm and have all this yeah. kelp. Yeah. And then I believe we can smelt the kelp into dried kelp that we can then use to make belts. So we're going to have to find... Uh, we, well, we, I think we... Did we start near like a, a bigger pool of water there's like a bigger like remember like a lake over in this direction it's not quite you know ocean level yeah i don't think but oh well i can see on the mini map there is something forming yeah i'm wondering if there's any kelp any kelp any wavy kelp <laughs> it's it's looking particularly uh shallow <laughs> kelp wise it's looking extremely shallow isaac I thought those fish were were kelp because they were animated, but they were just 
bluegills. Why, whatever even that is, Isaac. Also, I'm, like it looked for a second like maybe it went out into the ocean, but I think this is just a big... It's just a big lake. It's just a big lake. Yeah. There's another big lake that it kind of conjoins onto, like a pair of kidneys. Yeah, if you press M, you can see the map, and like below us, it, there might be another big lake, or potentially an ocean. Yeah. But we, it's possible we might have to go further afield to find uh, to find kelp. kelp. But once you have kelp, duplicating it's very easy, right? It's like sugar cane. Yeah, you just, yeah, you start your farm, you drown them, they wave around madly and then you you get your kelp it's definitely something we're going to want to get because those conveyor belts are going to help us move things around one mod that has not been ported nick is uh thermal dynamics so we don't have item ducts fluid ducts mm. flux ducts those guys we out of the equation the classic ver- variant isaac the classic yeah ver- variety so i think what i'll do nick is between streams i think i'll take a look around do some exploring try and see if i can find an ocean <laughs> to see if we can get some kelp get some kelp and then hopefully we can yeah, progress with our machines. Mm, yeah, we'll see if we can get a, a press. We'll see if we can get uh, the old fan going as well. Uh, and also, you know, there are other quests. We can get some storage drawers going, maybe for some better uh, resource uh, management and whatnot. Uh, you know, I'm sure we'll try and beeline towards a refined storage system at some point. Uh, Tetra is an interesting mod, four tabs down, uh, because it's kind of like a, it's a, from what I know, it's like a, a, a tool creation mod, like, like like somewhat like Tinkers, but it lets you create these custom, uh, custom tools, which I played with a little bit, but not too much. And uh, we also have stuff like power that's going to let us make, uh, you know, big custom reactors and uh, it also has its own like power transport and and charging systems as well, uh, which is cool. And uh, those resource bees as well, which people have been uh, recommending, uh, do seem pretty interesting. We can use new Minecraft bees to generate, uh, to generate resources like, oh, Nick, I don't know if you were near me at all. But uh, as I said that I did come across a beeper bee. Oh my goodness. You're you're across the lake from me. I'm staring. I was looking at a crow, Isaac, like a real crow. Like going, ah, and it's flying around. But I'll come over to you to have like this, a beeper bee. There's a skeleton bee and a beeper bee. As in like a bee that's actively swearing. I, I, I must, I think so. Maybe he's Maybe. been censored tremendously. I'm almost here. Hold on. Let's have a look. So this is from the resource bees mod. And I believe you can use these bees to generate like certain resources. Oh I don't know why. Goodness. Oh no, you're just behind you. Oh, yeah. So Hello. just over here, look at these two. Oh, yeah. The skeleton bee, and then that guy over there is the beeper bee. God, he's got a piece of TNT in him, Isaac. He no wonder does. He's, like, beep, 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 beep. he's going to blow at any moment, Isaac. I don't know Watch what that's out. about. God, he looks horrible. He looks like he's possessed. He looks kind of like a zombie bee, maybe like a slime bee, maybe like a creeper bee. I, I don't know, man. I do, who knows? I hate the little legs, Isaac. They're <laughs> really making my spine tingle, man. Jeez. <laughs> You're Absolutely not a fan? wild. Not enough fat. Like, uh, uh, oh, yeah. Someone says B plus creeper equals beeper. So maybe it's a creeper B. Ah, uh, that would make sense. Flip a name. Uh, yeah, and this uh, this little box here, this like uh, bee box, I think is a resourceful bee nest, I think is where they live. I picked one right. of these up earlier. Oh, I and, see. And uh, maybe we can use those to to tame them or something. I'm not sure. Imagine if they blew up like, <laughs> like regular. <laughs> Violently, yeah. <laughs> regular can creepers. Can confirm then they are a little bit tame. One of you flew up to me and like, like a like a cat just kind of like went prr, 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 and rubbed himself against me and then just went away again and didn't, doesn't care about me nice what the heck did i just get that achievement for i think it might be for going to this mountains biome be know. in an area with enough aura to cause positive imbalance effects <laughs> god sounds like uh sounds like we've been paying a visit to the bloody fortune teller isaac my oh, god there are a few if you scroll down like i don't know if you know if you press q at uh, the quest you can scroll down on the left here yeah, there's loads of There are of loads stuff. of quests. Yeah. Ars Nouveau. That's, I think that might be the mod that adds the aura that we're revealing. Like, oh, that right. I'm knowing about. It's a mod I've not played with, but I'd be interested to check it I'm out. i have to get into it, man. Yeah, for sure. But uh, for now, Nick, we're going to have to wrap it up there, I think, for uh, this portion of today's stream.